Hello, everybody. Well, it's almost Hanukkah, and it's almost Christmas, and it's time for the lighting of the tree last week. Did you see the tree out back? And do you know all Santa Claus has thought about you all year long, and every... Did you get my letter? Did you put a stamp on it and mail it? Well, I... Yes, I got it all, and I want you to know that you are coming to the best Christmas party in the world. You know why? Because we have cookies. We have yummy, luscious, delicious cookies that will make you fat like Santa Claus. And no one in the world is happier to have you here than we are today. And let's have a big old cheer, a Santa Claus cheer, for Colonel Irwin and the U.S. Marine Band. Hip, hip. Hip, hip. Hooray. hooray, hooray. Just wanted to see if you were listening. Okay, now listen, I wanted to point one thing out. If you'd help me look at these, you know, sort of, I don't have to hold this microphone. I'll bend over a little bit. Actually, I'll bet I could even make it come up a little if I worked at it. I want you to look around the room because our theme this year at the Christmas party is Christmas music or songs, you know. And if you look around, you'll see all sorts of different things that represent Christmas songs. There's a way in a manger, and we have different ones. And if you'll, everybody, turn around behind you and look, we have Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Do you see him? Point him out. Show me where he is. Hey, 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 where is, hey! Where is Rudolph? Rudolph Schmudolph. Hey, wait a minute. Who's, holy hey, Rudolph. what's going on here? Look, who's, hey, hey look, Merry who's, Christmas! I don't believe it! Believe it, hey, Santa! How you doing? What a team. Love the outfit. It's my favorite yeah. TV star elf. You look good in red. Holy mackerel. Ah! Ah! <laughs> yeah. Hey, you know what? Hey, tell you what. What? If if everybody, if everybody would just, everybody hey, sit down. down. You'll get no cookies. I'll everybody sit down because Alf has got to get back to the kitchen. Alf is making the cookies for us. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you know, there's been a little misunderstanding. Let's, let's, all, let's all be kind of quiet, because I want to ask Alf some questions. May I ask you a couple questions, Alf? You just did. I, I wanna, ah! Ah! That's yeah. fun. Come uh, on, we're on a roll, Santa. Yeah. 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 How's the weather, by it's the way? It's a sesame seed roll. Huh? I wanted to ask you You look about, like the guy who would know. Somebody What's the weather like outside? Somebody told me that you knew all about the weather. I know all about the weather, but I think you know more than I do. Well, I'm, I know more than I, you know, think I do. Are we going to get I, some snow? I just what? wanted to know where you come from. Do they have snow? Uh, yes, we do have snow, but it falls up. Oh, it goes from the ground up yeah. into the air. Yeah, it's crazy. And then, how do you sled in snow like that? Do you sled up the hills or down the hills? It's difficult. Very, it's very difficult. difficult. And how many times have you ever been in a sleigh yourself? Uh, no, I haven't. No, no. But, but I've I, seen pictures. And, and when, it, when it snows, do you have anything like a Santa Claus that comes and brings presents? Well, you know what? We don't have Christmas, but we have a, a, a holiday that's very similar to Christmas on Melmac. It's called Twangle. Hey, wait a minute. Yeah. Did you hear what he said? They don't have Christmas on his planet. No. But they have something called what? Twangle. Can you say Twangle? Twangle. Say twangle. Let's try that. Twangle. Uh, all together now. Twangle. What? You know what? That wasn't very good. Let's try that again. Are you ready? One, two, two. three. Twango! All what? right, don't shout. I could hear you. I said, Alf, I'm going to sit down. All right. And I'll let you tell us a story, and then I'll be back in a few minutes. And if you're really good, we will put you on the gong show. But if you're not good, you are history. Well, okay? there's a promise. I'll sit down and leave you alone. All right. I'd like to tell you a little poem that my daddy used to tell me. This actually happened. This is a true story. Have you ever heard the, uh, the poem, Twas the Night Before Christmas? Yeah? Raise your hands if you've heard it. Raise your hands if you haven't heard it. All right, I'm going to tell it to you anyway. Only this was called, Twas the Night Before Twangle. Now listen closely, because there's a lot of clever similarities. Twas the night before Twangle, and all round the planet, nothing was stirring except my Aunt Janet. Ha! <laughs> ah, ha! Yeah! She was stirring cat soup for our Twangle Eve dinner. And most of that soup was ending up in her. Now the twin moons of Melmac 
were shining that night, and cause it was twangle, one green and one white, one off to the left and one off to the right. But there in the middle I saw a strange sight. For out of the sky a red sleigh appeared. It landed and outstepped a guy with a beard. He asked for directions. He said he was lost. He was looking for earth and he got his signals crossed. Now my dad said to him, how'd you end up here, buster? He said he made a wrong turn at the Andromeda Cluster. It's not a candy bar either. We gave him directions and he got in his sleigh. We'd offered him cat soup, but he said, no way. So he thanked us for helping and he said he must go. Then he asked if we knew him. We shook our heads no. And then he took off and we both heard him shout, Merry Christmas to all. We had no idea what that was about. Now I had a strange feeling I'd see him again. I didn't know where, I didn't know when. And each twangle eve, I would look to the sky and I'd think of that sleigh and that jolly old guy. Now little did I know that I'd soon end up here helping St. Nicholas spread Christmas cheer. We're here as a team now. We've got a new angle. I say Merry Christmas and he says Happy Twangle. Ha! Ha! Yeah! Don't applaud if you're not sure. Yeah! Oh, listen, Alf, I want you to meet. Thank you for that story, and thank you, boys and girls. You are a great audience. I want you to meet the First Lady. Alf, this is Mrs. Reagan. This is Alf, Mrs. Reagan. Hello, Mrs. President. Can I call you Mrs.? Here. Here's, 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 is it me, or is there a lot of red up here? There's a lot of red. I see a lot of color red here. The background is red, and Santa wears red, and you look great in red. That's, oh, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. That's my favorite color. I know it is. I read that in People magazine. <laughs> and the president likes jelly beans. That's right. That's right. Well, Alf, I want to thank you for your... For your uh, oh, thanks. I'm a diplomat from another planet. Oh, you are. You are. <laughs> Thank you for your song, your rendition. Thank you. And, uh, and thank everybody for making this party possible. Um, and thank the, the members of THIS for making the party possible. Now, Alf, before you leave, before we leave, I have to ask you something. Uh huh. Who does your hair? <laughs> Well, I haven't had it done since I got here, to be honest with you. Back on my home planet, it was done by uh, Maurice of Melmac. Ah. But uh, while I'm here, Willard Scott will give me a comb out. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, the senator in the back's got a question. <laughs> okay, well, I was just wondering. It's, it's, uh, it's interesting. You like the color? Oh, I do? Yeah, it's I natural. I, I can tell that. It is. Yes. It's very, it's, it's interesting. <laughs> you have, uh, you want to answer? You have a couple of questions here. Well, just one. One. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Let's get the microphone. Hey, baby, you want to ask a question? What's your name? Hey, Alf. Have yeah. you ever eaten the cat? Well, say that again. I mean, Lucky. Did you ever eat the cat? Do I ever eat Lucky. The... I mean, lucky. No, no, listen, that's, that's a rap that I'm taking here, and I, I want to clear that up right now, all right? Since I've landed here on this planet, I haven't eaten a single cat. They've all been married. <laughs> ah! 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 Yeah! Next question. Who has a question for Yeah, a little for humor Al? in the White House. Any questions? You have a question? No. Huh? Who has a question for Alf? Anybody have a question? Anybody want to ask Alf a question? Okay, you'll have to stand over here. How about this little lady here? How about you? How tall are you? Help, in my stocking feet or with heels? 
I'm three foot two inches tall. Yeah. How about with heels? In heels, I'm four feet eleven. I thought you meant with me. Yeah. They're hard <laughs> Anybody to walk else a in question? Though. I look good, but I can't walk. Uh, on the TV show, you, you, you can't expose to the public, but now why are you exposing to the public? I didn't hear that. Why are you exposing to the public? You're not on television now. Why are you here? You know what? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you know well, why he's here, Mr. Reagan? When I came in the gate, they had a dog sniff me. <laughs> <laughs> he's here because it's Christmas. That's humiliating. You know, I'm a star. <laughs> Do you do that with everyone? Can you believe that? When Alf came in, the dog sniffed him. He did. And I the dog took him out and buried him in the backyard, and we had to go dig him up and bring him in here. And that's why his hair looks so good. You know, I know why you're here, Alf. Why? Because you like cookies. Ooh, the magic C word. <laughs> the, the big C. Yeah. Right yeah. Are there cookies? And right, and right now, and right now, it's time to go into the state dining room and have some cookies. Something to eat, something to drink, okay? I'm out of here! Okay. Have a Merry you, Christmas! Boys Happy and girls, holidays! Let's, let's give Alf a big round of applause and thank him. <laughs> and let's wish him a happy twangle. Happy twangle. Ready? And Merry Christmas. And if you all will be just a second, Mrs. Reagan and I are going to walk in and get the cookies and the punch ready, and then you hold on a second and you come in with us, okay? And Merry Christmas and God bless you all. What a nice treat. <laughs>